they're viable guys on the depth chart now. It's a great example of just every player progresses at a different rate. And it's a great example to us on the coaching staff to just keep coaching kids. One of the bright young players in his class that did bring more speed to the field, McLeod, uh, Tory Mack, Javaris himself, kids like that that bring more speed to the field than what we've had in the past. He loves to be in the game. He loves to do every, everything that you can do. His positive nature is infectious to everybody. However it shakes out, he's going to be a, a busy college football player next year. Always uh, uh, uplifting to all of us to see a uh, certain level of talent come on the field. And uh, you know, clearly, he's, he's a, his talent has helped us win games in the past. I think we saw today ample example of the fact that, that Mike Hell's playing much faster than we all saw him play last year. No matter what your system is, one cut running is the most efficient way to run. And he was a good one cut runner when he, when he really hit his stride the season before. Ron's team last year at Kansas State led the country in blocked picks. There's a method here. You know, it's not just, hey, this is a nice try hard deal. There's proven results. Any team can most quickly change their results on special teams than any other way. It's got real versatility of, uh, of talents, of skills, okay, real good speed, and some very, really crafty guys back there um, that have a, a real good sense of the game. You know, they're not just playing the coverage. And there's some very confident players back there, which is is as is important to playing back there as skills. We're one third through the practices that are allowed to us. We're allowed 44 before the first game. We've had 20, we've had 15 of those. If we make twice as much progress in the second third as we made in the first third, then that'll give us a chance to be ready on September the 5th.